adopting and fostering animals is one of the most rewarding things you can do. You will never get the unconditional love anywhere else that you get from a pet. And sometimes those pets end up in bad situations. Another rescue organization we are highlighting this morning in honor of Benny, Betty White's legacy and uh, Betty White Day and the Betty White Challenge is Beauties and Beasts. And I have Lauren on the phone. Lauren, what does it you do? Beauties and Beasts is a local animal rescue, and we work with shelters and communities to help animals who are in crisis get the love and care they need to thrive in a forever home. So the word crisis... Um, let's dig a little deeper into that. What are some of the situations you come across where you have to intervene, let's say? Animals who are sick, they run a lot of, we run across too many cases of parvo, and that's because people aren't vaccinating their pets. Um, so we, um, so a lot of animals that are suffering from parvo, we get them the care they need to get healthy. And that's a really painful virus, so it's really sad for the animals going through that. But we have many, many parvo survivors that are thriving and doing great and in their forever home. Animals who um, suffer from neglect or abuse of any kind, we rescue so many of those um, and get them healed, um, get them to trust, just to know that humans can be loving and that they're safe. And let's be clear, parvo is like a puppy pandemic. It's very contagious, right? Very, yes. So that's why vaccinating your pets is so important, especially when they're so young and um, they're so little, they may not be able to fight that virus off once they have it. So so important to give them the care they need just up front so they don't have to deal with that. Now, there's plenty of ways to help Beauties and Beasts. Uh, you can become a volunteer, a foster. You can just donate money to help their mission. Uh, so, Lauren, what's the best way for someone to donate or find out more about you know, volunteering or fostering? Go to our website. It is beautiesandbeasts.org. And you can read more about our mission. You can see all of our animals. You can fill out an application to foster, adopt, and volunteer. It's all right there. And we need all three of those incredibly bad, especially right now. Um, shelters are still in crisis and overfull. So fostering, um, adopting, and volunteering is so important, especially right now. All right. For the love of Betty White, let's do something today for Beauties and Beasts and the other favorite shelters and rescues in your heart. Uh, Lauren, thank you so much. And thank you to everyone there at Beauties and Beasts for the work you do. Yeah, JJ, we do have an event coming up. Can I promote it really quick, too? Yes, please do. Okay, so on Sunday, January 23rd, we will be at Ready Industries Activity Center from 1 to 4 p.m., and we're having a pajama party. So if you want to join us there, we'll have over 45 dogs in attendance to meet and fall in love with, and we're collecting items for ICT SOS Fresh Start Bags and you can find more information on Facebook. What a great idea. All right, good stuff. We'll put that on our calendar. Thanks, Lauren.